And that's just kind of the way she skates. Even if it, I mean, easy tricks for her, she's still going to charge and put everything she has into them. Moving along to the two-time SLS Super Crown champ in 2019 and 21, Pamela Rosa. She's down in eighth. She can do much more. There she goes. Okay, the lip slide is what got her in the first run. She recovered nicely, landed it. Kick flipping it up. Yes, hang it on. Oh, nice. <laughs> Wow. You know, Pamela just will fight tooth and nail to make sure she rolls away from everything. There's that crux. She slammed so hard on that in the first one. This was like the redemption run for Pamela. Back 5-0. And you know, she's always been a great friend of Kelvin Hoffler and they skate together a lot. And they're yeah. very similar in their ability to, to fall and then come back yeah. and not let it shake them. You know, it's a good life lesson too. You can't let the mishaps, the mistakes, the failures stop you. That was an incredible run from Pamela Rosa. Yeah. You know, she just steps up to the hardest, biggest obstacles on the course here at SLS. Like that. First trick in, gap out, front side lip slide. Not everybody can even get onto that rail to so to do a lip slide on it. Fighting that kickflip. Yeah. Hey, it's a contest make, that's for sure. Yeah. Far better than a fall. And on the first go, she slammed super hard on those crooks, but this time she came back, locked in perfectly, and stomped it. Back 50-50. Pamela just does laps around the course. She's going to be looking at a big score and a huge improvement over the point seven she got on her first run. 6.4 puts her right up there. A tenth of a point below Raisa Leal heading into the single trick section. Pamela Rosa, yesterday, her highest scored trick was a 7.6. See her career best, 8.1. So more than capable of getting the score she needs here. She's going for the big kicker to rail two. Front spin! Pamela Rosa, I have not seen her try that in practice. Didn't try it in the prelims. That's got to feel real good. Something on a grip tape. <laughs> Take a look. Again, the visible replay. Gap, front Smith, perfect. Sick angles brought to you. By visible all weekend long. Bolts. I just love Pamela's like aggressive style. She like wants this grind. She wants it. She wills it into existence. And that's just kind of the way she skates. Even if it, I mean, easy tricks for her, she's still going to charge and put everything she has into them. 7.8. Yeah, highest single scoring trick of today so far. Okay, Pamela looks like she's just taking a look right now. She's gonna size up that gap to ledge again. It's a big gap out. You know, Manny Santiago was saying you gotta quiet the noise of all the obstacles. There's a lot of distractions there. There's a big grass gap on the left. There's like a lot going on here. I think Pamela's just trying to quiet her mind before she attempts it again. She only needs a 5.7 to move into the lead. She's going to want to keep that in mind. There she goes. Beautiful. Stops it. And she's always been such a smart contest skater, really strategic. She has a, a, a ton of tricks to choose from. And there's a perfect example. Visible replay, gap out, crooks, perfect. Look at that big ollie out. Got to get that front truck onto the obstacle. Lean that body forward and just commit off of the end. And she, I mean, just barely got there because that, that's a far gap out to a tall hubba that ends insanely high. Yeah, and I was hearing some of the skaters say there's not a ton of runway at that approach for that hubba and for that gap. gap New there. leader, Pamela Rosa, 6.5. I mean, it all counts. Trying to add points. Wow. Yes! She puts down the backside Smith. A 6.9 moves her into the lead over Momiji as we move towards her this super giving her final. Props. Mm. Her mom's like, do a back Smith for me, honey. <laughs> Here she goes. You know, she does them so much like differently than Raisa. Like hers is a lot of power. 
a lot of force behind it. Kind of levitating yeah. a little bit. I think she may yeah. have tapped the rail, but she may not have. She wasn't like locked and dipped like yeah. Risa, but still beautifully done. I doing love it, it over the yeah. gap section. 7.2. Great score.